tan color. I still wanted it warm, so I wanted to keep it on the warm side. And I could easily, if I added enough blue, I could turn it into a neutral gray and make a color. Look at that. That's just about the same color as the tone of the canvas there. That was just by adding enough blue to the orange so I have kind of equal parts of both. And that way you can go from anything, if you have equal parts of complementary colors, then you should be able, right in the middle, you should be able to get a neutral gray pattern. And then if you tip it to the cool side, you can get kind of a, let me see where I might want to put this. You can get kind of a cool gray color. And then you can keep going until you're back to like an actual blue. Um, so it's kind of a continuum from like blue to orange with a gray in the middle. So that's all I was doing here. Was I was just knocking down the intensity of the orange with its complementary color. Which is not exactly what's up there, but I'm not going to go in right off the bat and paint every single one of those little uh, details in there. I probably won't get to it tonight at all, except for maybe suggesting it, but... What kind of blue did you use for the... Uh, uh, the shirt and the hat? That was cobalt blue and cobalt teal mixed together. 